Brothers and sisters in Christ, grace and peace be with you all. Before we begin, let us lift our hearts in praise and gratitude to our Almighty God, who sustains us and fills our days with his abundant blessings. Now, let us turn our attention to the book of Colossians. Colossians chapter 4 verse 2, devote yourselves to prayer, being watchful and thankful. Throughout the letter to the Colossians, Paul addresses various challenges and false teachings that had emerged within the church. He emphasizes the preeminence of Christ, urging believers to stand firm in their faith and not be led astray. Within this broader context, Paul specifically highlights the importance of prayer. He calls upon the Colossian believers to devote themselves to prayer, indicating a continuous and unwavering commitment to communing with God. This devotion to prayer encompasses both individual and corporate prayer, for it is through prayer that we establish and nurture our intimate relationship with our Heavenly Father. Paul further encourages the believers to be watchful in their prayers. This vigilance involves being spiritually alert, discerning, and aware of the spiritual battles we face. Prayer becomes a powerful weapon against the schemes of the enemy when we remain watchful and seek God's guidance and protection. Moreover, Paul urges the Colossians to approach prayer with a spirit of thankfulness. Gratitude is an essential component of our communication with God. As we recognize his faithfulness, provision, and grace in our lives, our prayers are infused with heartfelt thanksgiving, drawing us closer to the heart of God. In our fast-paced and often tumultuous world, prayer can sometimes become neglected or reduced to a mere ritual. Yet, the words of Paul remind us of the vital role prayer plays in our lives as believers. When we devote ourselves to prayer, we open up a channel of communication with our Heavenly Father, allowing His wisdom and guidance to shape our thoughts and actions. Through prayer, we find solace, strength, and healing in the midst of life's challenges. It is in prayer that we seek God's will, surrender our burdens, and intercede for others. Let us, therefore, recommit ourselves to a life of prayer, being watchful and thankful. May we set aside dedicated time each day to commune with God, to bring our joys, concerns, and supplications before Him. As we cultivate a spirit of prayerfulness, may our lives be transformed and may we experience the peace that surpasses all understanding. Before we conclude, let us come together in prayer. Heavenly Father, we thank you for the gift of prayer and for the privilege of approaching your throne of grace. Help us, Lord, to be devoted to prayer, watchful in our spirit, and filled with gratitude. May our lives be a testament to the power of prayer and may we bring glory to your name in all that we do. In Jesus' mighty name we pray, Amen. Brothers and sisters, it has been a joy to share this time with you, reflecting upon the profound truth found in Colossians chapter 4 verse 2. May you continue to devote yourselves to prayer, remaining watchful and thankful in all circumstances. May God's blessings be upon you as you go forth into the world, living as faithful witnesses of his love and grace. See you tomorrow.